So guys, if you're interested in buying the Battle Pass Season 10 and you're wondering is it worth it, then this is the video that you've been looking for. So first things first, I'll not go in depth about all the new things that have come, but more about exactly what Battle Pass offers. So when you take a look at this button, which is view all rewards, you can actually check all the skins it offers, all the bags, pickaxes and everything else. So as well, you can go for cycle sword, which I don't actually know what it offers, more like how many V-Bucks you can get for each tier and what specific style of the last battle pass kind of skin you get as well. So then take a look at these things. In my opinion, the first skin, this kind of girl, it's kind of decent. Which one I like the most is the last battle pass tier and this kind of cat looking skin as well so you'll be able to get a shield which in my opinion looks kind of cool this thing uh not that much the dragon looks amazing the question is only if the sound which it produces is actually good then of course as well you get battle pass challenges which is for every battle pass then here you can see a another battle pass tier skin yeah it's basically the same thing just with a different color the last season 9 I liked a lot better. So here you can see basically you will get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So you'll get 1,500 V-Bucks by spending 950. So for sure if you have already 950 V-Bucks you can make a lot more like per usual. Then here we can see another skin which is the Kevin's Cube. So this skin particularly will not be moving a lot like we can see on the right side. It will have actually no animation whatsoever so if you enjoyed that that will be cool here is a even more style this thing this skin actually was from the previous season so i don't know why that is there then we have actually one of interesting skins which the girl almost half of the body is moving with animation so that's kind of interesting this this particular which is wonder skin for me it's a bit too much it will look cool with the Vader skin, but then taking a look at this thing, which is the internal Voyager, which was as well in a one of the season eight or nine. Actually, this is my favorite skin so far as well at end the tier nine skin with this thing is even better. So guys, to be honest, I think I'll buy it just because of this skin. It actually looks really good. Then going over here is even more. Let's say, of course, the animals. Like per usual, then this. Mm, this is actually interesting with the crown and stuff. Here is even better level. Of course, like per usual, guys, you'll have to complete challenges, get tiers and more. Then going over to the pickaxes. The double pickaxe thing I really like, but my favorite most, I would say, is the sparkle scythe. It kind of looks cool. The most important thing is that the animation is not too much. Nor there is actually an animation as well for the gliding. Here we can see uh, this kind of looks cool, then not so much. This is actually interesting. Then for some, what is this? A bottle flip? Oh, this is basically a, yeah, uh, one of the emotes. Let's see, let's see. And then here is just a bunch of emotes. So V-Bucks have been bought and let's go back to Battle Pass and let's click purchase, click and Here it is. So the first things that we'll get is basically an XP boost. Here is a skin, here's another skin, and then we get all the challenges. Okay guys, so whenever you'll buy the tiers at the start, you'll see these two more skins. So we'll go for edit style, and here you can see a another tier with a hoodie with overcoat, and then the actual final tier. And here will be the colors, which you'll be able to get white, red, that's basically a rift kind of looky, and here at the start then going over to the second skin which we'll get at the tier one is this one which we'll go on edit style here, here you can, can see is xlord he takes off his clothing then here is with another white green and red color so like i said we'll just go into the fortnite creative and see how the skins actually work okay so first things first here you can see how the actual skin looks like while it's gliding and with the previous glider so for just 
showing off the skin this is how it looks of course i have the skateboard backpack but that doesn't matter so this is how the skin at the tier one will look like and here of course we'll be able to build a bit but mainly this preview just made so you are able to basically see if you like it if you're not and again take a look at the second skin here you can see as well how it looks like while it's gliding so and we'll do the same thing here you can see from the sides how it looks like of course guys in the future if you want to see the gameplay of them or whatever let me know and we can do that as well but for now this is it so with that said i really do appreciate it for watching and i hope you enjoyed this was my basically season 10 battle pass tier overview review is it worth to buy it and so on and so forth so guys let me know will you be buying and which skin you like the most this were my opinions in my opinion if you ever wanted to buy a battle pass this is it which you want to buy you'll get all the new pickaxes all the skins all the challenges boosts and everything else and on top of all of that if you enjoyed the video don't forget to click like and subscribe to keep up to date with whatever list i make review over you or anything else about fortnite and don't forget to enable the notification bell so you would be notified when a new video is up and running thanks for watching guys hope you enjoyed it my name is Kate. you have an amazing day and see you guys in the next video take it easy peace Yo, I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the fame Though it might be nice to own a jet plane I'ma do it all for you, come along and see it's true But the world